Yo, what's going on, Sexy Seven Letter Squad? Today we're doing a ranked 1v1 uh, announcement, as always, like I say in pretty much every video, on the 10th this week, Friday, December 10th at 6 p.m. Eastern is when it's starting. Doing a 24 hour live stream. It's going to have a bunch of stuff. The, the whole. A lot of stuff. <laughs> Probably more stuff than any of the other live streams I've done. The 24 hour live streams I've done. Why? Yeah, there, I mean, there's definitely, there's, uh, here's a few things that might happen. Sours candy in the world. Uh, I shave half my beard. Uh, might dye my hair. You know what else might happen? A sexy Santa might show up. That's right. That's right, a sexy Santa might show up. So it's going to be filled with a bunch of fun and a bunch of trolling. So it's it's a, it's a lot of fun every single time I do it. And um, yeah, come come hang out with me on Friday the 10th, starting at 6 p.m. Eastern. Um, Why do you have that item on? I mean, yeah, obviously you get that, right? I'm not doofus, but why do you have that? Did it get buffed? I actually haven't been paying attention to patch notes for like a couple months. So is mannequins garbage now? Because the fact that an Apollo wouldn't build mannequins kind of blows my mind a little bit. That being said, he does have red buff and I'm out trading him. So there's no way mannequins is bad. Okay, never mind. He hits like an absolute truck. Ouch. Dash into me. But dash into me, though. But dash into me. Oh, you are so close to being deceased. It's insane. He's not level 5 yet. So I'm okay as of right now. But if he gets level 5, I will get ulted and absolutely clobbered. But yeah, so anyways, there's a lot of fun stuff that's going to be on the 24-hour stream. Again, that's... Twitch.tv says Sam the Dude. Friday. Starting at 6 p.m. Eastern. Friday the 10th. And, uh, and yeah. But he is, he is slightly ahead of me. He may be ulting me right now. Keep that in mind. If he ults me, I'll scream and run. Okay, he didn't ult me, so no screaming and running yet. Okay, he did show up here. I'm very quiet right now because I feel like my man's about to... Oh my god. Ah! Okay, he didn't ult me and I know I said I'd scream and run if he ulted. And I screamed and run and he didn't ult it. He... he English? Hello? <laughs> yeah, I speak it. Um, no, but... I don't, I, don't, I don't know. I feel like he should have been more aggressive there with his ult. Just done it, you know what I mean? But then again, I don't know, he has B as I have med. But maybe he didn't know that I used my med. Maybe that's why he didn't do it. If he knew I didn't, if he knew I had med down, there's no reason in the world he wouldn't dive that. I think. Other than the fact that my name rings fear into his heart. Which is not me saying that, it's him saying that because he told me. Oh my ouchie. Oh, the two or the three didn't hit. Let's pop the multi pot just in case he does ult me here. Because his one hits so hard. Oh, you're dead. Dead to the archer mannequins tick damage combo. Grabbing this. Yes, I would love coffee. Thank you, baby. Um. Okay, he might be ulting to red. I tabbed out. How do I get back to my game? There we go. He said, big fan, be gentle. AKA, that's him saying, you scare me, don't kill me. All right, here's the thing. Here's the thing. Here's the thing. I'm just going to zone him out of this entire wave. Extra, extra 200, 200 numby pumping. 200 numby pumping. Oh, look at that damage, though. You have Transcendence, too? Oh, one auto, one auto. Oh. Man, these minions that are on me 
really saved his life. They really do be like that. Blue is only halfway spawned. Hold on. Suicide, suicide, suicide. Easy. Call me squad. Get it? Because the movie Suicide Squad. You know what's funny? That movie got a lot of hate. Pretty much specifically just for Jared Leto. But they still made a second one. And you know what's even funnier about that? I haven't heard anyone talk about the second one. <laughs> there was so much hate on the first one. They still made the second one, and I've heard absolutely nobody talk about the second one. That being said, even though Suicide Squad got a lot of hate, I didn't think it was that bad. Like, don't get me wrong. It's no Marvel. It's, you know, but it wasn't that bad. Hello? You're Okay, that was a little bit of an odd play by him. Dash in there. Do I do enough damage? The stacks. A little bit of an odd play by him to dash in there. Maybe he was expecting me not to have alt up. But it's been a few minutes since I ulted, so I don't know. But I really would love blue buff. Please don't ult. Oh, fuck. He's ulting. Hide. Oh my god, it worked. Holy shit. He doesn't know where I am. Oh my god, it worked. I actually hid from an Apollo alt. That shit's bonky McGee, man. You don't scare me. Holy crap. Is Artemis, like, actually OP? Are you gonna dash in and, like, try to hit me with a... Oh my god, thank god that he missed his one. I peed. I actually peed. That scared me. I mean, I didn't actually pee, thankfully, because I went to the bathroom and I peed before. But if I hadn't gone to the bathroom before, I definitely would have peed myself just now. Do I go Aussie? Oh, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to do the combo. I'm going to do the rune forged. The rune forged, uh, what is this? Frostbound hammer. Hold. Rune forged frostbound combo. He doesn't have all. Is he? Yeah, red. I don't hear him, but I also don't see red buff. Oh. He beats it. I don't know why he beats my thing. Maybe because he knew I was there. Maybe because he dropped, he had a ward there and he knew he had the beads my, uh, he knew I had the beads my, thi my, what, what is it called? My trap. If you wanted to stand a chance. I'm not doing bull demon. I was going to do bull demon, but then I realized it's power still up. There's no reason for me to do it. Other than like, if I was behind, I would do it right now just because I don't want him to get it, but I'm extremely far ahead. So. Right. Oh, 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 okay. Holy crap. How many autos did I just miss? Like eight? Oh my goodness. You know, for somebody who's not killing me, he's really making me look bad. <laughs> just goes to show you, man. This goes to show you, you don't need to do damage to make the other guy look bad. Unfortunately for me. That trap ticks for 42. Kind of incredible. Um, I could dive with my alt here, but I think I'll just take tower. I don't think I waste alt here because I might need it in order to do bull demon in the future. Because, yeah, I'm going to take tower here. Clear wave. Get my frostbound hammer to increase my damage permanently with the combo. Um, For those of you who don't know, by the way, Artemis passive is that she does 15% more damage to gods. 
who are afflicted by a crowd control effect. And that doesn't mean any crowd control effect, including a slow. And Rune Forge gives you an extra 20% damage if they're uh, affected by a crowd control. So, using Artemis passive and Rune Forge, just by hitting them with one auto attack, I do an extra 35% damage. It's pretty ridiculous. My first auto hits him for 110. My second auto hits him for 160. It's pretty dumb. But this is just how people build Artemis, man. It's it's the play. You don't need to build. Yeah, baby. Oh. You saw right there on those minions, though. The first auto was 220, and the second auto was 330. Just straight up 50% extra. Oh. But that's because on minions, it's, you know, on minions, you do an extra 30% damage. On gods, you do an extra 50 So against the Apollo, I'm doing 35% more. Against everything else, I'm doing 50% more. Which is absurd. And definitely should not be allowed. Oh, he was slow immune. So he was slow immune or just generally CC immune because of the fact he was ulting. If he wasn't slow immune, he probably would have died there. Probably just ult him. Gets a little bit too close. Dude, look at that damage output. Holy crap. Artemis is not one of those gods where you think of... Thank you, babe. She's not one of those gods where you think about how much burst damage she really does until you play her. And then once you're once you're like actually in the game, you understand, holy shit. <laughs> Wait a second, this might change my life. Oh, almost. You know how there's a couple gods in the game? And I don't I don't know if this is just a me thing or not, but God's like um trying to think of an example for me that's like chiron i don't like playing chiron until i'm playing chiron you know what i mean like locking in chiron feels like such shit and then i'm in the game and i'm actually playing him i'm like oh this is this is nice <laughs> i don't know if that's just a me thing maybe that's just a me thing but oh i'm so deceased here duke it hold on hold on hold on duke it Oh, it's, so easy. it's too easy. Now I come back in. I come back in. Hit him with the hit him with the boar. Hit him with the root. Hit him with the three. Big burst damage. But yeah. So what was I talking about? Oh yeah, picking Chiron feels like crash. Like it doesn't feel good. But then the second you're in the match and you're actually playing him, you're like, wait a second. I should play Chiron a lot more often. And then the game ends and you're like, oh yeah, fuck Chiron. You know what I mean? <laughs> It's the same way with Artemis for me. I love playing her, but I hate picking her. But I don't know. Uh, go in the comments. Tell me what you think of the build. Tell me what you think of um, the conversation at the end there about if you have a god that you hate picking but love playing. And also, tell me how freaking hyped you are for the 24-hour stream in three days. It's going to be super sick. I'm excited. Um appreciate you guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you did enjoy the video, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Let me hit him with a GG Giga Gamer. I'll be gentle next time. Okay. Peace out, boys. Thanks for watching.